Now, it's interesting that depending on which source you're looking at, people have completely different opinions on Shiba Inu coin and whether or not the price is going to recover. In this video, we're going to take a little bit more of a bearish approach to Shiba Inu coin because this article says Shiba Inu coin metrics hint at a low chance of recovery. And, and although that may be true, the overall market right now, that's dictating the price of Shiba Inu coin. It's dictating the price of Dogecoin, Pepe. It doesn't matter what coin or what token you are looking at. The overall market, the price of Bitcoin, is dictating direction. We're going to be talking about that, and I'm going to go over a token that I think could, in the near future, break out and actually see up to 3x gains in a very short period of time. We're going to talk about why, and if it sounds like something you're interested in, let's get started. What's up, everybody? I'm Clay, and as you can see, we've got a beautiful article on the screen right now that absolutely deserves being discussed, because if this was the only article you read today, you're going to start to think bearish thoughts about Shiba Inu coin, and I don't think that that's necessarily fair. Now, it says Shiba Inu metrics hint at a low chance of recovery. An assessment of Shiba Inu coin's price performance at the last time it posted a monthly gain was in May. Now, the last time a lot of meme coins posted a gain was in May. The market, the overall market, especially Bitcoin, started to fall on June 5th. You can look at Solana meme coins. You can look at Shiba Inu coin. You can look at Bitcoin itself. June 5th marked the beginning of a very strong descent. And of course, because of that, yes, May was the last time we have seen gains and the last time we've seen a monthly gain in something like Shiba Inu coin. Since June, the situation has changed with some market participants suggesting that broader market might be sliding into a bear phase. Now, let me say this, right? This bear phase that they're talking about is not because of any major catalyst. In fact, if you look at the overall market right now, it is nothing but strong, positive, bullish catalyst after strong, positive, bullish catalyst. You've got ETFs in talks of ETFs. You've got presidential candidates here in the United States talking about making the U.S. the crypto capital of the planet. Guys, if that's not the most bullish statement you've ever heard of in the cryptocurrency industry, I don't know what is. Look, these people understand something. They understand that they live forever. They are institutions. They understand that they essentially have unlimited money. They can print it anytime they want. So when time and money aren't a constraint, the only thing that they need to focus on is accumulation. And one of the best ways that they can accumulate is to not let you go out there and own any, but to shake you out. Because there's only a limited supply of coins or cryptocurrencies like Bitcoin. Now, because of that, they understand that they can't just go out there and buy it all up because there are some people who are unwilling to sell. So what do they do? They trick you into thinking that, well, there's a low chance of recovery, that it's never going to go up again that you're facing nothing but bearish pressure. And when they convince you to sell, they go in and they buy it. Now it says, while some holders may be hoping for better performance this month, the network value to transaction NVT ratio suggests that tra chances are slim. Additionally, historical data from the 2021 bull market shows that September has typically been quiet or bearish month for Shiba Inu coin. <laughs> Guys, uh, who cares? right? Who okay. History does not have to repeat itself on the exact same monthly time frame. But let me ask you one question, right? You're looking at the 2021 bull market, right? September slow. What happened in October leading into November? If you had the chance to travel back in time, would you go to November when 2021 when Shiba Inu coin is hitting an all-time high? Or would you travel to September when Shiba Inu coin was trading at lows? When Shiba Inu coin was stagnant and stale? When you know that you could accumulate as much as you possibly could leading into that rally that occurred just one month later? It, 
I'm just going to tell you, you are wrong if you said, I'm going back to 2021. You go back to the time that you can buy and accumulate and so on. And that is the time that we are living in right now. So ignore all of the negativity. Push through. They're trying to shake you out. And let me tell you one thing that you don't want to ignore. And that's T1500 token. Guys, I am, I'm invested into these celebrity meme coins out there, right? I do have T1500. You can see the watch list on the left. I've got Jason, I've got Mother, and I've got Daddy. I truly believe that when retail begins to pour back into the cryptocurrency space, they're going for meme coins. And I think there is an excellent chance that they go for these celebrity meme coins because they are so heavily exposed to them that when they have a choice between some cartoon animal and when they have a choice to invest in some of their favorite celebrities, well, let's figure out which one they're going to go with when they've been bombarded with celebrity kind of endorsements for the previous months weeks, maybe even years, if that's how long it takes for them to return to the market. Now, this one is a much shorter time frame investment here. T1500 is is the Tate or uh, I get yeah, the, the Tate 1500 mile journey. Jake, this kid is walking from the United Kingdom all the way to Romania. It's a 1500 mile journey. And he's walking to Romania to meet Andrew and Tristan Tate. Now, he is only about a week or two out from meeting these guys. And as you can see here, the technicals on this chart are still very strong. Yes, it had a nice rally about a month ago, and it started to pull back. We get it. But look at this. Double support at this horizontal line. That held up. And you've also got an ascending trend line right here, which is continuing to hold up. Not only are the technicals strong, but you have a very strong catalyst on the horizon that is going to be coming to fruition in the next couple of weeks. If you're looking for 3x gains, they're absolutely obtainable, attainable because that just takes you to the previous all-time high at a very small $5 million market cap. Now imagine if T1500 began to shoot up and it reached a, a market cap similar to Daddy. Daddy is currently sitting on a $48 million market cap. Guys, not only would it be 3 to 5x gains, but then an additional 10. You're talking 30 to 50x gains just to reach the market cap, the current low market cap of a token like Daddy token. T1500, I'm excited about it. Look, these guys are getting ready for the next push higher. And if they break out of this resistance level at 002 or the $2 million mark, the $2 million market cap, this token can absolutely soar back up to its previous all time highs. And of course, if it breaks it there, it is only in the head of the holder how high they want to take it. If, of course, they're willing to sell, the token's not going to go up. But if they're willing to hold, as new demand begins to roll in, the price is going to break through the previous all-time highs, and who knows how high it's going to go. There's a lot of bullish sentiment in the cryptocurrency space right now. You just have to push through all of the bearish sort of manipulation to get you to sell your tokens so that, of course, the whales, the institutions, the venture capitalists, and yes, the governments can buy those tokens. Let me know what you guys are doing down in the comments below. And until the next time, hope that each and every one of you have an awesome day.